Thank you. Uh, earlier this week, candidate for governor Katie Hobbs Phoenix office was burglarized. In a statement, Hobbs blamed Carrie Lake for inciting the crime. Today, Lake responded. Nine on your side's Tina Giuliano joins us live breaking down what Lake had to say today. Tina. Yeah, Pat, so Phoenix police arrested 35 year old Daniel Mota Dos Reis. He took a few things from her office, including a camera and some Apple computer equipment. But now it's back and forth between Lake and Hobbs about what is truth. After the theft, Katie Hobbs released a statement blaming Carrie Lake for inciting the crime, saying in part, Carrie Lake and her allies have been spreading dangerous misinformation and inciting threats against anyone they see fit. Today, Carrie Lake responded to her opponent. She puts out a statement about a petty theft that happened at her office. She knew darn well that I had nothing to do with it. Condemning the media for pushing the story. Blaming me for a break-in. Now, hopefully by now, you figured it out, but that's part of the plan. You don't care about the facts. You know the facts will come out later. When the theft happened on Monday night, Lake says she was at an event. While I'm meeting with police officers and firefighters working to make sure that our state is safe, she's pulling stunts. Hobbs put out a statement today saying she's glad the police caught the thief and quote our campaign to stop Carrie Lake's dangerous chaos from becoming our new reality. Lake says she hopes the lies stop. Stop spreading the garbage that the Arizona Democrat Party and Katie Hobbs and the Democrats are spreading and start doing your job. Both candidates say they won't stop fighting to keep Arizona safe. Tina Giuliano, KGUN 9 on your side.